My favourite memory has got to be when we got to try physical theatre lifts for the first time. It was really different to anything I'd done before, but we all laughed so much trying to do them. It was a lot of fun. Uh, one of my favourite memories in drama is when we spent the whole lesson trying to attempt a frantic warm-up exercise, which was called quad. And it was all about trying to work with your classmates and get your timing right to a particular rhythm of a song. And in order for it to work, you needed to have your timing and everything needed to be perfect. So it was a real collaborative experience and we all had to try really hard in order for it to work and when we got, it took us so many times and when we got it done, like when we got it perfect, it was just, it, it, we all celebrated so much because it was so much fun. My advice for someone who wants to study drama would be that you need to be ready to fully commit to rehearsals, but you also have to be willing to just let go and have fun with your characters. If you want to study drama, you've got to be, as I said, confident, you've got to be willing and open to new things, you've got to be able to work with other people, try different methods, adapt to different directors, what frantic, stuff like that. You need to not try and just get out of that, past that boundary of awkwardness and like nerves and get to that point of feeling confident with a group of people so you're able to perform and produce some of your best work because once you pass that some of the stuff that you do is so will be so amazing what have i taken away from studying drama for the last two years well at the start of the course i was dead set on doing an english degree after college because i didn't think drama would take me anywhere and then i fell back in love with the subject and I learnt so much about the different careers and the different aspects of the industry that now I am starting a drama degree in September. So yeah, drama really changed my mindset. Um, I think what I took away from it is that I was actually really proud of myself because I feel like it's a really hard subject and you've got to be really confident and re come really out of your shell to work with people and you've just got to pass those awkward boundaries to get to know people and once you do that and you make friends with your class and your teacher, it's, it kind of turns into one big family. And to be able to make pieces to perform to other people and to gather feedback and work, as, just to be able to work as a group, I think that's really rewarding to be able to work together and just achieve something from it, in a way. Drama lessons at college can consist of theory lessons, so you will sit and discuss set scenes from your texts and talk about the intentions and dynamics that are created from those, but then you're also able to pair those with a practical activity, so being able to put the scenes that you've discussed on their feet. You'll also have a lot of time to do devising and scripted exam rehearsal and be able to explore the techniques and methods of your practitioners, so Katie Mitchell and Frantic Assembly. We were able to apply those to set texts as well as creating our own short performances using these methods. Of course it's quite a physical subject and you need to be able to trust other people and just be able to take criticism and work on your, work on your own acting skills and performance skills and writing skills and to be in a class where you can share ideas and help with other people's performances and get feedback on your own to help improve your work. It's really rewarding and it just feels like you can be whoever you want to be in there and you don't have to feel criticised and nervous because it's not like an everyday classroom where you're sitting at a desk and a teacher's teaching you things. The teacher, the teacher like helps with your work and like comes and improves and shows examples and you get feedback from other people in the class and it's just really a nice atmosphere. It's not scary at all once you get to know everyone and work with people and their different acting styles. It's really fun to go teach lessons. It is a very fun subject to do because you can be creative with it. If you make a mistake, it doesn't matter because that's the joy of drama. We can try it again.